Heather Vaughn. I'm here with the Unadoptables at Forever Paws Shelter in Fall River, Mass. And we're here to show you what they have to offer today. There's an office manager. Hi guys, I'm Heather with the Unadoptables. Hi, I'm Peter. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Erin. I'm the shelter manager here at Forever Paws. And today we'd like to feature some animals for the Unadoptables. Uh, we have Missy and Luke, who are two senior Cocker Spaniels. They're about 10 years old, and we'd like them to go home together. And we have Claire, who's a cat, um, who's been here for over 700 days. And she's sweet, and she deserves to go home. Mm -hmm. Hi. Oh, God. All right. Hi, Luke. Oh, How's it going, oh. pal? How old are you guys? Good boy. They're I, 10. I think yeah, somebody they're 10. lied. They're 10. You 10 have years old. a lot of spunk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, they, they have a lot of them. Yeah, they're just funky. <laughs> but when one leaves, the other one gets withdrawal. Oh. Withdrawal. Oh yeah, they're both. Yeah, yeah. she went to they the are. vet and Ooh, had yeah. a mammary oh, gland yeah. tumor removed, oh, a baby. dental, and a spay. He cried all the and time. And he Hi, didn't I eat anything baby. since he was Aww. here, and he Hi, was like Hi, out as hell, looking Hi. everywhere for her. Hi, he was crying. Oh, he he was not him. himself, no. so they have to stay together. Hi, pal. <laughs> oh. Nice, sweetheart. Oh. <laughs> I'm here with Missy and Luke. They're 10 years old, but their age is very deceiving. As you can see, they're really feisty, really spunky. 10-year-old uh, Cocker Spaniels, um, both fixed, vaccinated. They are former breeders um, that are pulled from a negligent situation in New Bedford, Mass. They've been here now for about a month. Um, they're a bonded pair. They do need to remain together, as you can tell. Very playful, very sweet, good with other dogs, cats, and children. Um, would make an excellent addition to any family. So true to their breed, Missy and Luke do suffer from ear and eye issues, but they are treated. Um, and Missy also recently had a mammary tumor removed. But obviously it hasn't, you know, stopped her from doing what she likes to do, which is being lovable and playful. She bag. sees the bag, actually, That's yeah. What it is. <laughs> oh, no. You just want something scratchy, huh? She's just in heaven right yeah. now, not oh, having yeah. to compete with anybody. Sure. Yeah, she just... This is Claire. She's a five year old female cat. She's spayed and up to date on all her vaccinations. And she's been here for over 765 yeah. days, I believe. Yeah. So, um, July of 2013. July of 2013. Um, as you can see, very playful, yeah. friendly. Um, she'd be best in a home as the only animal. She doesn't tolerate dogs very well, but could possibly tolerate other cats. Um, but she is definitely a diva and likes to have her own attention and her own space. So she is long overdue for a home. <laughs> she gives kisses. Forever Paws Animal Shelter is a 501c3 no-kill animal shelter whose mission is to rehome homeless animals. We rely strictly on donations and fundraising. Anything that anyone can give and help donate will help the animals in need. 
Hi, my name is Peter. My wife and I train dogs. We volunteer at Forever Paws Animal Shelter. And if a dog does go home, and there are any kind of issues or any kind of questions, you can always contact us and we offer free advice for all the dogs because we don't want them returned. We want a really happy home and we want you to be able to take, take care of the dog and, and be in harmony with them when, you, when they do come home. I'm Dr. David Miller, I'm the medical director of NEMRA and we're proud to be sponsors of The Undoctables. Hello, son.